Hi Leo, this is my channel Psychic Love Tarot. Welcome to my channel. On this channel, I do tarot readings for the people from all around the world in English language. So please like, share and subscribe to my channel. Right now, I'm going to do a reading for Leo people that what will happen from 15th of May till 31st of May 2022. What I'm going to do is first I'm going to pull out a cross spread from this tarot deck and we'll see what will happen overall. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some cards out for your love life. And after that, in the same video, I'm going to pull some some extra messages from Gypsy Cards. So watch the video till the end so you get all the messages. Let's start with Tarot. And if you're interested in buying a personal reading with me, I do these readings on video called Skype. So if you're interested in buying a reading, you can just add me on Skype and we'll take you from there. My Skype ID is written on the screen right now and it's also in the description of this video. Okay. Uh, messages for Leo. 15th to 31st of May. 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 Messages for Leo, 15th to 31st of May. Messages for Leo, 15th to 31st of May. Okay, Leo. One, <clears throat> two, three, four, and five. So the first card in the center is strength. So right now, Leo, uh, something is blocked or lots of things are blocked. There is a blockage I see in some situation of your life, most likely in work or uh, something like that. So it's like uh, maybe some of you uh, uh, have stopped it by yourself or it is like stopped. I, I, it's a block. It's a blockage. So... Uh, you want something to happen, but it's not happening. Before, we have six of swords. So you came out of the darkness, you entered the light, you uh, came out of the turbulence, things were better. Some of you traveled uh, lately. Uh, you were traveling or you traveled, but not for everybody, of course. Uh, things were all right, uh, but then... Uh, now things are blocked again. There is some blockage I see for you. In your mind space, we have King of Pentacles. So you're all about finances and money right uh, now. At this point in time, you really want uh, uh, your focused, your mind or your thoughts are focused on uh, uh, like uh, your uh, practical situations, your finances, your work. Uh, and things like that. Uh, so you uh, want to uh, basically make your financial situation better at this point in time. Underneath we have tower. So your heart space is not in a very good point at this point in time and you are like uh, there is a chaos, there is a trauma, there is uh, uh, some of you maybe ended something or something is not going well as far as your emotions are concerned. Uh, so the emotional state is not uh, at the right place right now. And uh, uh, overall, I feel uh, that, uh, yeah, things are, things on the surface are not very chaotic, but inside you there is some chaos there is some mess there is some uh i don't know some agitation some restlessness which is going on now what's coming towards you is death card so uh, basically some of you in the second half of may are gonna end something it can be anything uh, maybe you'll end something and uh, you'll feel that okay this situation or whatever it is it's not serving me uh, so you can end something or there will be a major transformation uh, 
uh, a major alteration in some area of your life. It's a shift. So the second half of May is basically a shift in uh, maybe overall for some of you, uh, like a life-changing thing for some of you, not for everybody, but uh, it can be one situation ending, one phase ending and you entering a new phase. In the background, we have nine of pentacles. So you're going to be very uh, free-spirited and independent uh, in the second half of May. And I think your financial, if you are having any financial issues, I think they're going to resolve in the second half of May. Uh, and also you will be very, like you'll have your own comfort zone and uh, you'll be feeling very good about it and you'll be feeling very relaxed uh, in your comfort zone and you'll be enjoying that. Now let's pull some cards out for your love life. Uh, love messages for Leo. 15th to 31st of May. Love messages for Leo. 15th to 31st of May. Love messages for Leo. 15th to 31st of May. Okay, Leo. Uh, one, two, and three. So there has been a tussle going on with this emperor here. So in your love situation, there has been some ego, some uh, stagnancy, some tussle, some power game, like power. There is a power struggle, I feel here. Uh, so maybe you're being stubborn or maybe you're being like putting your foot down that, OK, I want things this way kind of energy. So there is a power struggle. Page of Swords. So you are, may, some of you are doing uh, something online, online dating or online messaging or uh, things like that. Uh, but overall, I think you are deeply analyzing your love life right now. Uh, whatever is happening in your love life, first of all, you're doubting it. You have some doubts in your head. So you are deeply analyzing and you are deeply uh, thinking about it and uh, contemplating about it. And uh, I don't know, maybe keeping an eye on somebody or uh, just otherwise analyzing it deeply. And then we have Knight of Swords. Some of you are thinking of cutting some situation out of your life or it's like uh, you are ready to defend yourself. So you are ready to snap at somebody. Uh, it's not a very positive energy. We have swords here, a lot of swords here. Uh, so I guess uh, you're too much in your mind and uh, the thoughts in your mind are not very positive at this point in time. Now uh, let's pull some extra messages from these gypsy cards with these extra messages. You have to keep that in mind that these messages uh, will not resonate with everybody. If they resonate, it's fine. If they don't resonate, just leave it. Don't worry about it. Okay. Uh, what else for Leo? 15th to 31st of March, May, sorry. What else for Leo? 15th to 31st of May. What else for Leo? 15th to 31st of May. Okay. So you have a person around you uh, who is not thinking in good interest for you. So that's a caution. That's a red flag and that's a warning for you. So do not trust everybody around you. What else for Leo? 15th to 31st of May. This card jumped out. It's about sadness. You, I don't know, you are down somehow and you are, some of you are even sad and not in a very energetic mode and you are down, emotionally down. What else for Leo? 
15th too. Okay, you're going to get some money. You're going to get some money in the second part of May. So that's we talked about before that your financial situation is going to be all right because you're going to receive a good chunk of money unexpectedly maybe for some of you and uh, you'll be happy about it. So please hit the button like if you like the video and give me a thumbs up. You can subscribe to my channel if you like what I do. And thank you so much for watching the video. Stay blessed always.